I'm Cynthia Carlson, president of the New Britain Symphony Orchestra, and I'm here with our conductor, Toshiyuki Shimada, to tell you about our upcoming season. We were just discussing what a wonderful season we had. Toshi's first concert in November had the largest audience in living memory, and the orchestra never sounded better. Our Christmas brass quintet and organ held here at South Church had 210 attendees and three standing ovations, and our February concert at the Plainville Library set a single event attendance record. We had real enthusiasm and excitement last year, and we feel that we're going to carry that through to the upcoming season. And Toshi would like to tell you about what we've planned. Thank you very much, Cynthia. I am Toshi Shimada, as I was introduced by her, uh, music director of the New Britain Symphony Orchestra. Indeed, we had a fantastic first half of 2019-20 season. My first concert was so exciting. Orchestra played tremendously. Audience was really supportive. And then that momentum carried on until, of course, uh, spring of this year. And it was like a big fire curtain came down all of a sudden, and we had to seize our old activities. Now, uh, while we are not performing, we have been uh, planning uh, wonderful events for the future. A uh, lot of planning, yes, uh, not certain when, whether we could execute these programs, but we are hopeful that that will happen and we'll bring back to you exciting, beautiful music to you alive. Uh, so we have planned two major concerts for the Springs. Uh, the one is on March 21st, and I hope by then we get to perform and uh, we get permission from governor and uh, all the health, health department to be able to do this. Uh, the location not known yet, actually, but we will f uh, let you know as soon as we find out. But uh, we have a proposed date of March 21st. We are going to start a little bit smaller in orchestra size to, for the safety of all, uh, for everyone. And so it has a kind of a quasi Baroque music and some contemporary music that has smaller ensembles. And so uh, also in this spring season, I'm thinking of some social themes. Black Lives Matter, for one thing, uh, social justice. And so I like to bring uh, two composers who are African American. And uh, so the first one in March will have uh, George Walker, his uh, lyric for string orchestra. Lovely piece. It's just like Barber's Adagio, if you are familiar with that piece. And uh, George Walker, unfortunately, uh, was not so famous, not known. And, uh, you know, just to know that he died actually in a matter of less than 10 years ago. So, any case, so we're bringing that piece. Along with, we're planning to feature, feature, feature our uh, orchestra player. And uh, at the moment, uh, we are planning, again, this is just planning stage, to, to feature our principal flutist, Jennifer Berman, playing the Charles Griffiths poem for flute and orchestra, small orchestra, that is. And uh, we will also bring the fantastic Baroque music by Johann Sebastian Bach, uh, his orchestra suite number three, which has the famous air in G strings movement. And uh, also, they're also planning other various other pieces, but uh, I just will wait until that time comes soon. So, we have another concert in the later part of the spring, in May 23rd. Uh, we are trying to bring back some of the pieces that we, we couldn't perform this past season. And uh, the namely the Chopin's Piano Concerto Number no. Two in F Minor, uh, featuring Eva Virsik as a pianist. And, and uh, this this is for the tribute to Polish community here in New Britain, in the way. And we will continue with the Black African uh, American composers piece, and also women composers piece. 
and in this, this two factor goes into one composer. Florence prizes overture number two for orchestra. Price, unfortunately, is not very well known to us, but uh, I think she, her music needs to be heard. She really deserves uh, really good attention. And uh, of course, wonderful women composer as well. Uh, the program also has that Brahms Second Symphony, which is the most romantic piece of music. And uh, so I'm very excited about this season. If we be able to perform, then we're just really, really praying that it's going to happen. I also realized when you were talking about the concerts that we don't have any titles for them. Mm -hmm. yeah, Why don't we have a contest? Mm -hmm. I name the concert contest that everybody can send in suggestions looking at the program and the winner could win two tickets and a shout out in the program booklet and possibly it could be judged by an impartial panel of jurors. Yes. You and me. I think that's something to look forward That'll to. Be fun. It'll be fun. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. It's, it's, it's their orchestra. Yeah. Uh, donating to the orchestra means guaranteeing our future and the future of your orchestra, New Britain Symphony Orchestra. We are for you, we know for the others, but for this community. And so please consider donating. Our annual appeal letter will be going out in the next week or two, and we're asking you to please be generous. We are looking forward to our 75th season in three years and our fifth season with Toshi, and we want to be an active, thriving orchestra representing New Britain and all of you. Please be healthy and safe, and uh, we also look forward to performing for you live. Stay safe, be healthy, and we look forward to seeing you in person soon.